People say to me, oh, you get better when you get older. Cock! Look at me, ankle problem, man. Knee, knee operations, hip replacement. I take 40 medications a day. I've got flatulence, constipation. My lungs sound like a fucking coffee machine. <laughs> the quietest thing I can hear is a Boeing landing. I've blurred vision and my short-term memory's gone. <laughs> and on top of everything, my short-term memory's gone. <laughs> then you go around a cop station and the whole place is filled with pictures. Have you seen it? Pictures of South Africa's most wanted criminals all over the walls. Have you seen it? These men are armed and dangerous. Do not approach. Oh, why didn't you arrest them when you took the pictures? <laughs> now I was driving along here, I thought I was a bit late, so I put foot and this thing stepped off the verge. I thought, do it, you're not strong enough. <laughs> but I managed to stop and he approached the vehicle, wearing the Ray-Ban sunglasses, with the mirror on the inside. I said, excuse me, sir. He wasn't Afrikaans. <laughs> I said, I want to see your license. I heard him, my license went, ish. Yo, 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 yo. <laughs> I said, Mr. Miller, you should be wearing glasses. I said, I got contacts. I said, I don't care who you know, you must wear glasses. <laughs> Did you hear Julius and Malema the other night? Oh, good love the man. I don't even have to write shit anymore. Uh, people who are anti-revolutionaries are saying that the ANC Youth League are, are, are trying to embarrass the ANC. How? Oh, it's not true. <laughs> the ANC can do that all by themselves. <laughs> <laughs> now, I've been, I've been in this business for 46 years, insulting people. And I think I'm joking.